My friends, I've let you down today. I have let you down, my friends. I'm sorry. What up, everybody? Welcome back to Mario Maker. Today we're gonna be checking out a super creative course called Guitar Hero, and uh, it's got two paths. I'm hoping to do both. There's a hard and an easy one. I've seen the easy one. I haven't really seen much of the hard one. Uh, but it looks super cool already. You see like the guitar pixel art and like the guitar neck. It's like a musical thing. I don't. I don't know. Let's dive in. I, I really wanted to play it after I saw it. All right, so we're gonna go in the door. Let's see. Okay, yeah, we get the tanuki, nice and quiet. What's in here? I don't remember. So hold on, I think we need comments for this. So if I turn the comments on, okay. So we've got two things here. We've got, uh, and we have some instructions. So, okay, you go to the left to listen. We'll check that out in a second. Um, and we use the mushrooms here to indicate what action we need to take. So if we see a red mushroom, we do a tail swipe. If we see a, a orange or yellow, whatever color that is, mushroom, we do a jump. And if we see a green one, we do a duck. There are two, ver it's basically two levels in one. You've got two different songs. You've got a Tetris song, which is the easy one. And then you've got a Skyward Sword song, which is the hard one. And then we've got a listen here. Let's go in here. Oh, you can actually go and listen to the track before playing it. So let's go into the Tetris one and take a listen. You can even practice. I don't remember what the colors mean. Just jump, swipe, oh. oh. I'm fucking it up. But look at it, like basically what he's constructed is this crazy mechanism where you're inside the cannons and you have to do these actions and uh, let's just dive in and give it a shot. All right, so we're back to the main room here. So we're gonna go for the Tetris one. Let's see if we can remember this. So we've got tail swipe red. So red is swipe. Uh, red for raccoon, we'll remember that. Red is raccoon, because we got the raccoon tail. Uh, brown is for jump, brownish, yellow, puke, orange. I don't know what that color is. Tan <laughs> for jump and down for duck. I'm gonna mess this up a few times trying to remember which one's which, but red for raccoon, brownish for jump, and green for duck. Green for duck. Okay, swipe. Oh, I fucked up. Hold on, I forgot already. Wait, was that... Which one was it? No! Red was jump, right? No. Red for raccoon. I did already forget. <laughs> okay, okay. Red for raccoon. I made that thing up and I still couldn't remember it. So red for raccoon. Uh, and then duck is... Okay, okay. So... I missed the duck. We did... We are doing good, though. I don't have a raccoon, so I'm screwed. Duck for green, and then raccoon. Raccoon jump. This is so cool. All right, here we go, here we go. Ah, oh, I missed them up, we were doing well too. I keep mixing up uh, jump and duck. And he has it laid out really well too, like where the top one, the middle, and the bottom. So really all you have to remember is that top is raccoon, Middle is jump and bottom is duck. Okay, let's go. Yes, yes, yes. Such an awesome stage. I think we got it. I think we got it. Hell yeah, we got it. Okay, cool. And we got keys throughout the way, too. Little tail check there to make sure you still have it, and we drop on the goal. Hell yeah. So good, that's so cool. Okay, now we're gonna check out the hard one. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how that's gonna go, but we'll see. No star for this level until we beat the hard version, so we're gonna get into Skyward Sword. Let's go and give it a listen. And see what we're getting ourselves into here. Okay, we're gonna preview the song right here. I was trying to actually practice it. Dude, not only is the shit creative as hell, but the tunes are off the hook. You're not supposed to run through it, but I still heard it and it sounded so good. Okay, let's go. I wanted to practice, I accidentally jumped up and fucked it up. 
Okay, let's do it. Here we go. Here we go. What did I do wrong? I thought we I thought we nailed it. What happened? No! I missed the blocks. What did I miss? Dude, we I thought we one-shotted it. What did we miss? What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? My jump timing must have been off. Okay. Focus. Yep, my jump timing was off. Shit. I jumped too early, so the jump ones have hidden blocks containing keys, so that's how you, that's how you, you collect the keys. Damn, I was so excited, I thought we nailed it in one shot, man. Not quite, not quite. That is tough. That part is fucking tough. We got the keys, but we got fucked. <laughs> that part where you do tail swipe, jump, tail swipe, like, to get a key, that's really tough. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Get in there, get in there. Do we got it? Do I do I have the keys? I missed a key! <laughs> no! 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 We got this baby, go for the cheese! Go for the cheese! Go for the cheese! What if there's like a hidden key in one of these? I think it's worth exploring. Oh, alright. So close, so close. Prematurely excited twice. Definitely got it that time. No! My friends, I've let you down today. I have let you down, my friends. I'm sorry. Focus soon. Two. Get the third, get the third. Got it. There we go. There we go. I'm not a key short this time. We are in there. Hard path complete. Honestly, it wasn't that bad. Not even the hard path was that bad. I got tripped up because I kept jumping a little too early and missing those key coins, but, or those keys, but. Such a cool level, man. This guy says most unique level. I agree. Like I said, I haven't seen this before. Maybe this guy just copied it from someone else. It's possible. If that happened, well, props to the original creator. I fucking love it. It's so cool. I know it'll, this will probably be a shorter video today. I just wanted to showcase the level, do something cool. Uh, maybe we'll check out one more level from this guy before we go. He has a lot of music levels here, I can see. I'm inclined to check out his newest level, which is called Breath of the Wild Hyrule Castle. That's pretty cool. Back to the back to back wall jump. This actually looks like a tough level, 0.67%. That's random. So, like a non-music platform stage, should we throw that in? That sounds fun, let's do it. Why not? Get in there, by Jim Zan. Let's see if you make good platforming stages too. I am so dead right now. What was I supposed to do? Was I supposed to go up right away? Jump, jump. What? Oh, I get it. I get it. We need to go back to that donut. 
We need to go back to the donut and then wait for the saw to pass. I think that's what the arrows are trying to tell us there. See how they're, I mean, they're pointing to go back, right? So. I went way too early. Okay. That's it. Dude, this is, this is really uniquely designed, I will say. Okay, nice, nice. Am I supposed to go to the grinder, jump over? I think so. Let's try that. Damn. That's snug. We should take... Wait, can I jump on top of those burners? I don't know if I can get up that high. That part's actually not that hard. I think we need to spend more time sliding on those wall jumps. We need the cannon to get up higher. Before I jump back to it. Oh shit, that was close. See, like, see how low the cannon was? Like, that wasn't very useful to me. Are we winning? Oh. Ah, where do I go? What am I doing? I think we broke it. What's in here? Hey! We got a checkpoint. Hold on. Dude, did we just cheese the hell out of this level? We cheese the hell out of this level. Look at all that. Look at all that. I suspect, I suspect. Hold on, let's go back. Let's go back. I think what he wanted you to do was go all the way around the course while this thing slowly broke open the path to the door. I think you would go all the way around and come back from the right, maybe. I don't know. I don't I don't know. Let's keep going. I'm just making shit up. That's my theory. Uh-oh. What do you do here? Oh, I see. I see. Oh, that's cool. That's kind of tight, but I like it. Okay, we're gonna go for a ground tech. Ground pound. Ground pound tech. Dude, that, that trick has been really useful on this stage. Okay, I see what to do. Alright, let's try not to fuck this up. No! Dude. I thought we were golden. That this is fun platforming. I really like this section. This is a good level. It's got it's got really creative use of uh, items on tracks to facilitate these wall jumps, and uh, you know he's using the same thing. So you like go in between them, you wait for them to pass, and all kinds of cool shit. I'm wondering if if this gentleman though knew knows about the ground pound tech here because like that trick really makes this level nice. Like, in ways he may not have intended for. Oh, shit. Like, this is fun. This is fun platforming. It's tough. It's tight. But it's it's not, like, over the top, though, you know? Oh, my God. That was my bad. Like, it's tight platforming, but it's not, like, disgustingly over the top. Don't jump too early now. Yeah, he even has a coin all the way down there. Got it. There we go. Yay! We did it! We did it! Where's my secret stuff, man? Alright, turns out that Homeboy not only makes amazingly awesome Guitar Hero levels, he also makes pretty cool platforming stages, too. I'm gonna go ahead and give that level a star. I'm pretty sure we cheesed the hell out of it. Let's download it and take a look. Alright, let's get under the hood of the stage, so... Huh. Look at this. This is weird. Like, you go up here, there's... That's the, that's the cannon we were using. Okay, so... 
what I suspect is that he breaks the ice and it works out so you wall jump through the area. And when you get through here, it's not quite completely clear yet. Uh, maybe to about this point it's clear. So hold on, let's 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 test it out. Oh no, that is that's not how you want to do it. Okay. So you're jumping around. This thing is slowly opening the gap here, and then this part opens up, and then you're forced to go in here, go down here, and then you have to do more stuff to keep stalling while you wait for the path to open. But look, we off screen the skewer, so... Oh my god, I'm gonna die! So you keep going around, you keep going around, and you finally work your way all the way up here, and then you get sight of the skewer again. The grinder, whatever it's called. Oh, god, you don't do that. But anyways, you get up here, and then you can watch it clear the rest of the way. Looks like after it clears the way, you come back down here. The way will be clear. And then you jump, you jump back in. So we did, in fact, cheese the hell out of it there. But honestly, it's pretty easy to cheese because all you have to do is stand on the edge like we did. And just wait. Because it won't hit you. Yeah, because I just went right here and waited. Hello. <laughs> I love cheese, it's so delicious. Super cool stage though, man. Like, very unique, very fun platforming. Uh, I like it. All right, everybody, thank you all for joining me for this. I wanted to showcase the Guitar Hero level. Uh, we got through it pretty quick, quicker than I thought, so I thought we'd show off another level from this guy. I was not disappointed. This guy is named Jim Zan. I don't know this guy personally, but uh, thanks for the levels, dude. Really, like like I said, I have not seen the Guitar Hero level before. Uh, if this was his original creation and no one else has done this, well, bravo, man. That's awesome. If it's not, well, whoever made it, fuck yeah to you too. Um, it was so much fun. The music was on point, like super creative. It took me back to early Mario Maker uh, live streaming. I used to get so many levels that were so creative and so good. Now most of the levels are either trolly as hell or just satanically difficult with not a lot of creativity in them. So it's really refreshing to see some cool shit. Um, yeah, nice. Oh my god. All right, everybody, thank you all for joining me for Super Mario Maker. It's been a blast like always. I'm about to die. Goodbye, friends. Got to check out some cool levels. Uh, yeah. I had a really good time. Uh, I really love playing that stuff. Can't express it enough. If you guys know of any super creative stuff, like, let me know. Tweet that at me. Holler. Tell me how cool it is. I would love to play it. Hey, it still has our pal that we put in. Nice. I can chill. But yeah, those are my favorite levels. So if you have anything like that for me, tweet them at me. Hit me up on Discord. Do some stuff like that. Uh, let me know. I'd love to see them. I'd like to showcase more creativity out there and, like, you know, not just playing the latest hard level or whatever. So thank you all so much for joining me. It's been awesome as always, and I will see you in the next video.